Welcome, everybody, to the Music City Open. We're here at uh, Nashville, Tennessee, J.O.B. Billiards. This is a winner's side match. We're down to about, I don't know, 18 players or so. And you've got an awesome match here. Shane McMinn out of Oklahoma versus Jesse Bowman. And I guess Jesse's originally out of Iowa. I'm not positive on that, but he's an awesome player. Got to uh, watch him for the first time play down at the White Diamond Tournament down in Louisiana. And uh, good, good player. Always fun to watch. And Shane McMinn, man, he's a great player, too. This is going to be a great match. Uh, certainly got our money's worth on that last match between uh, Cliff Joyner and Hennessy. Hill Hill. Hennessy taking that down. Everyone uh, on the chat seems to like Bowman in this. Uh, McMinn wins the lag and will be breaking first. around the room there and get the uh, what can I get the players a uh, something to hold their cues with so they don't sit them on the tripod all right guys um, uh, 
on the stick raffle there, I, I uh, Jim Blaylock started uh, getting nervous about selling selling some tickets online. He doesn't understand how it works. I had to explain everything to him, and I'm just waiting on him to get this, the green light to get back on. If you've already got tickets, you're in. And uh, <clears throat> so I'll just hold off right now. told them they just need to get busy and sell more tickets here in the building. <laughs> All right. Shane McMinn. Uh, let me get the score update. Is it 2-0 already? Wow. I don't think either one of these guys take too long at the table here. Coming to the table. A great opportunity here. Everything's pretty much wide open. <coughs> Four to the fives. If you had to call anything tricky, that would probably be it. TV. Jesse got right up on the rail here. He didn't like this at all. Money 3 0. Jesse Bowman being shamed to win. heard uh, Jim Blaylock announce that we are selling tickets online, so raffle tickets are now open again, folks. It's official. Anyone that would like to uh, get in on that raffle, it is a $2,000 queue, and you know, I guess uh, Jim was getting, uh, <laughs> getting a little nervous about buying that queue. We did add $300 in additional prizes uh, with the OB shaft and the Delta rack also, so... And he just had to had get his head around it. Yeah, I understand. So if someone could post the link up to the raffle. Also, it's at the bottom of the chat in, in both Ustream and on Pool Action TV. We're going to get someone to watch this shot here. He's going he's gonna to try to uh, let's take another look at it here. He's going to try to make the two, that's what he said. So he's going to come in rail first here. Peg Lippman watching the shot. Well, he made a good hit. But no love. Uh, the drawing for the raffle prizes will be right before the finals on Sunday. And that will be right before, um, right here on the live stream table. Everything, uh, the tickets sold online will help, help support the streaming uh, and the, uh, the expenses involved in it. And if you're uh, planning on coming here in person, you can support the event here as well and uh, pur purchase some tickets here in person.
Jesse Bowman rolling forward here, folks. Now leading three to zero over Shane McMinn. I gotta tell you, Shane's a tough customer too. Uh, Which bracket you're looking at, but um, uh, I just checked. Oh man, Shane cannot catch a break here. I, I just went and looked at the, uh, the brackets on uh, Pool Action TV, and uh, everything looked good. Oh, stop! Don't start talking about filet mignon. Does that do sound good? Uh, Jesse Bowman. Shows coming up. Uh, I'm going to be down uh, doing uh, something a little bit different uh, for the big truck show, which I like to mix it up, as uh, you all probably already figured out. I'm going to be down at the APA team event down in New Iberia, Louisiana next weekend, uh, filming the Tri Cup tournament down there, the eight ball Tri Cup team event. It's going to be interesting, to say the least. And uh, then the week after that, I may have my mid-level tournament and stream it in Waco. I'm not sure. I haven't verified that with the venue yet. Uh, if we can get uh, if we can get the venue, we will have it. And then the following weekend, I'll be heading up to Tulsa 
for the T-Town Classic that uh, is being put on by Gabe Owen Productions. And made possible by Mueller Products and Magoo's Jim McDermott up there. the T-Town Classic 12,000 added guaranteed and that's that's a that's a real guarantee and there's the number if you'd like to get entered in that there's also going to be a $500 ring game last I heard from Gabe last night there are still two spots left in that and I suggest you get on the ball in. You can only be put in by someone. Uh-oh. So if anyone uh, has a player you'd like to put, enter into that uh, Midnight Madness tournament, you need to get on the stick and get a hold of uh, Jim Blaylock up here. He's taking entries now. Uh, when I was up at the booth a few minutes ago, I saw there was four entries that were paid, and another fellow was paying right then. Getting a little upset here with the rolls he's getting. It's not a terrible roll, but I can collect. Oops. Sorry, guys. Couldn't get it switched fast enough. All right, Shane concedes, and uh, Jesse pulls ahead five to three.
nice billiard on the uh, two eight there. Shane's got to come down underneath the five and three there for the three ball in the side pocket. We've got uh, Amanda billiard chick seven from the uh, AZ forums is playing in a match from the back here right now. Some of you on the AZ forums know she's not 16. Nice shot by Shane there. They got a good angle on the five. Do about whatever he wants to for the six. Jesse Bowman that's still leading five to four over Shane McMahon. Shane gets out that back, tightens it up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to check the board. Um, we're gonna have a little offside match over here next. Wow, don't everybody leave. Three balls on the break and a clear shot on the two ball. Five. Looks like it does pass the eight nine. that makes a uh, camera switching a real challenge.
the two ball drop, but it hung right in the jaws there. Nobody home. <clears throat> oh, wow. Look at this. I think Shane can see this. One, nine. That's seven balls making it a narrow lane, but he... If you can't see it, he's got a billiard. I mean, not a yeah, billiard off the one from the behind it. I think you can see it though. Nice shot and ties it up one more time. <laughs> neck and neck, people. We got a match here. shoot here. He wants to be out. Push. Well, he, he's going to push. Okay, he's going to tempt Shane here to cut it down the rail. Shane's going to take a quick break. Okay, ladies bracket, one cross side. Here's some breaking news. Inside Pool Magazine can now bring the world's greatest players right to your front door. Subscribe to Inside Pool for the annual price of just $19.99. Each issue is action-packed with high-impact photos, tournament coverage, in-depth player profiles, and much, much more. Call 888-428-7665. That's 888-428-POOL. Shane McMahon is taking a short break, and he'll be right back here in just a minute. We're here at the Music City Open for the 22nd Annual Music City Open here at J.O.B. Billiards in Nashville, Tennessee. This is Ray Hansen, also known as Big Truck, from the Internet Pool Forums. If you're not watching the show over on my new website, PoolActionTV.com, I'd like to invite you over and check it out. PoolActionTV.com. Uh, same viewer, same chat as you have on Ustream, only nothing but pool. And we're going to be working on that website constantly uh, with the help of uh, Inside Pool Magazine. It has helped me set that up, and uh, he's doing a good job with it. Uh, Big Truck will be doing some tweaking on it also. But it just keeps looking better. If you have any input on the website, too, I'd be interested in hearing what you got to say. Uh, I uh, want everything to be user-friendly and uh, and something we all like. I watch a lot of streams myself, so I, I have some good ideas on what I like, but I'd really be interested in hearing from you, the viewers, as well.
guys. I uh, stepped away for a few minutes and uh, trying to scout out our next match over here. And uh, who won that last game? I still have 6-6 six, six on the board, as y'all can see. Y'all would let me know who is up right now. a little bit. If it's too loud, please let me know, folks, on the internet. Here we go, rack number 15. Nice break. little tester shot here, one ball in the corner on the bottom left of your screen. If anyone has any updates from uh, any of uh, tournaments going on back in Texas, the Lone Star Tour or the uh, Bar Box Tournament down at Temple at the Green Room. Appreciate some updates on that. I know it's early. They, those, those events just got going a little while ago. We're in our third day already here, and we will be wrapping things up tomorrow. Uh, I was talking to Peg Letman, uh, the assistant tournament director over here, and it looks like we're going to have a one-loss side match coming up uh, next, and it's, it's going to be a good one. We're getting down to all good players. Um, this is the final round of the winner's side for today, and uh, the, the one-loss side will play down to eight players, and we'll be back tomorrow. For, oh, we missed that bad. We'll be back tomorrow for a uh, – the act no, actually, they're going to have the players' auction tonight for the final 16. And then immediately following that, we'll be having Midnight Madness. Okay, just got an update from the uh, Lone Star Tour event down in Houston, Texas, run by WPBA pro Kim White. And uh, Jeremy Jones has won his match. Raphael won. Hillbilly and Zed Thweb all won right now. No, Hillbilly and Zed are playing right now. Ooh, that'd be a good match. Turn that table mic down a little bit for uh, his rack in there. Jesse Bowman pulling ahead. Eight seven over Shane McMinn. Seven and this rack is Tom Cruise run out from here.
Professor Bowman pulling ahead. Now the 9-7 over Shane McMinn. Guys, if you haven't visited J.O.B. Billiards out here in Nashville, you need to stop by when you're out this way. Big truck always stops in J.O.B.'s when I'm coming through here. It's kind of a halfway point for me between here and the East Coast. I always stop by and try to out for a little mini tournament or a little small tournament on the weekly on the way over. safety here, more than likely. Guys, if you're just joining us and you haven't got your raffle tickets yet, you won't believe the, the item that I've got here that they're, they're raffling off. The grand prize here at the Music City Open is an, a $2,000 Alex brick with two shafts. And it is stunning. I'm going to show some pictures of it here in just a second. And the uh, other prizes that you can win are going to be a OB shaft of your choice. Any OB shaft, uh, you get to pick it. Any of their standard configurations in a break, OB1 or OB... Wow, went right around the one. Tough break. And you could also win a Delta rack. So... Get your raffle tickets. Those are 7 for 10, 15 for 20, or 50 or more for a dollar apiece. And we've uh, joined in on the raffle that uh, the Music City Open is conducting here. Added a few prizes to it, as we've been doing lately. Oh, Jesse came up a little shy on that one. Get your raffle tickets is right at the bottom of your chat. And it is. Oh, how do you hit that? So nice. It's yes, right at the bottom of your chat there. Just click on the uh, link for the fundraiser. It's Alex Brick, Delta Rack, and your choice of OB Shafts. You have three chances to win, all of which remain the entire time. Seems like Shane needs to settle down and, and take his time on the break here. And uh, you know, he it. he's going too fast for me. He's just he's just throwing them up on the rack and, and hitting them. And look at this. Big difference. He was taking his time earlier and he was pocketing two, three, four balls on the break. Jesse's got him on tilt. Plays a nice safety here. You know, if you got your player on tilt, you might as well go ahead and move it around a little bit, make it hurt. That's what Jesse's doing here, playing the safety. I think he might have played that two way, but <clears throat> he got lit up on the two ball. And the two nine is not on. Come Shane with his shorty out. Clear shot at the table.
is it? Enough shy on the sixth one. I'm gonna go real first here. Jesse Bowman. Wow. He narrowly puts it in the side pocket. Nice table, though. He's got a clear shot at the one ball. Doesn't have to do anything with the cue ball, really. Oh. Look at this. Came out. Missed it. And caught a roll on it. Wow. The cue ball did a little left turn there. Fresh everything while we're doing that. We're gonna take a little tweak on the table, the level, and the stereo level, and, and a couple of wrenches. So hopefully that'll help things out. Well, this is it, folks. Three balls from uh, being over here. And the Shane concedes. Jesse Bowman takes it down. Eleven to eight over Shane McMahon. All right, we're gonna we're gonna hammer on that table real quick.